So everyone keeps asking questions on how to solder uh, power wire. So we're doing the install on the uh, the VW right now, and we've got some eight gauge, and it works for any power wire, whether it be like four, zero, something like that. It, this uh, this will just be smaller than what you normally have. So what you do is you take the torch and you'll apply heat. Well, I'll show you in a second when I pass it off to my friend, but you'll apply heat to the back of the terminal while adding solder to the front, and you'll slowly fill it up uh, with a pool. So let me hand it off and fire up the torch, and I'll show you what I mean. All right. So apply it to the back of the terminal, way at the top, maybe like 10, 15 seconds, because the entire thing's got to heat up. The idea is to get it all more or less one temperature. So you're not applying the flame directly to the solder. You're applying uh, the solder to the to the hot metal. That's not uh, hot enough. The solder's not melting on it. And this is going to take practice, and <laughs> there's no way I'm perfect. Mine probably look horrible. If you've done this for a while, and you're probably going to Stay minor dumb. And then slowly feed it in. I don't think the wires are hot enough because it's not sucking up the solder. There we go, that sucked it in. I don't know if the, the camera picked that up. <laughs> Sorry. All right, just one more dab. Fill up that pool, make it look nice. All right, that pretty much filled it up all the way. And it's going to be really hot, and then uh, once that cools, we'll throw a boot out, and it'll be good. I personally prefer to, to solder everything I do, because um, if you just crimp it, I've had uh, stuff pull out a lot. As soon as you give it any kind of pull, it pulls out. But this one uh, should stay really solid. Alright guys, see you later.